sun, crowds, and lots of really, really big boats. Where else but the Fort Lauderdale International Boat Show? At the show's 50th running, boat introductions were down, but there were still plenty of new models to see. The Bertram 540 is a true offshore battle wagon. New company president, Alton Herndon, says the boat will help restore Bertram's reputation as a hardcore, kick-ass sport fishing machine. It took a couple of tries to christen two new tiaras, the 3100 Open and 4500 Sovereign. If you're feeling deja vu, that's because the 3100 debuted more than a decade ago. With this reintroduction, David Slickers, chief executive, says Tiara is going back in time to the boat that made the company a success. It was tequila on tap as Cabo Yachts unveiled its 44 Hardtop Express Sport Fisherman and then threw a dockside party for visitors. Don Smith, vice president of sales at Cabo, says the boat is a game changer. Designed 100% for fishing, but with the comforts of an express cruiser. Yanmar had a Parker 2530 extended cabin on display with a six-cylinder Yanmar diesel coupled to a ZT350 stern drive on a bracket. The system includes an inverter system for power. One potential customer is the offshore angler looking for more range. Double what you get from the outboard configuration. Volvo Penta let attendees experience the ease of docking with its IPS pod drive system. ZF Marine and CV Boats debuted what the companies say is the first single pod propulsion application in the recreational marine market. Senior reporter Chris Landry got aboard a CV340 center console powered with a 480 horsepower Cummins Mare Cruiser diesel engine linked to a ZF transmission and a ZF2800 series pod. Kohler introduced its new line of low CO emission gas marine generators. The 10 kilowatt unit is the smallest on the market. Greg Wilkinson showcased SpotHug, a satellite-based GPS security device that watches for low battery voltage, high bilge water, door or hatch intrusion, smoke or fire, and alerts for unauthorized movement. The Hinkley Company introduced drawings for its new Talaria 48. The Down East Lobster Boat is designed to cruise at about 30 knots and top out in the mid-30s. The Fort Lauderdale show usually sets the tone for the upcoming boat show season. With the sun shining, attendance up, and a noticeably more upbeat consumer, this year's show bodes well for 2011.